Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Akshada and yes, this is my new video. This is not kind of a you know sewing tutorial that you would expect. This is just me trying to sew a dress for myself for the very first time. So I hope all my viewers will you know accept the little little mistakes I'm doing while you know making this dress. So yeah, I hope you won't be that harsh. And yes, you can see the result is amazing. So why not just move forward with the actual footage rather than just talking? So let's start. So it's like whenever you are creating something new, looking for inspiration is must. And my first ever preference for an inspiration is Pinterest. So here it is. So it's like out of nowhere, one day I randomly decided to make a dress for myself for the very first time. So I visited nearby a fabric market and I was looking for a specific type of fabric which will be easy to sew for a beginner. So yes, I found this amazing one. This is cotton fabric and yes, obviously it has mushroom embroidery on it. And such type of fabric is mostly used to make a summer dress. And yes, this one is going to make a beautiful eyelet summer dress. So as you can see the fabric is little bit transparent that means I need to put an extra layer of fabric as lining inside the dress. As I'm mentioning again and again that this is my very first time making a dress. So yeah, I had to make a pattern for it by myself which was like you know very challenging. I literally pull out this top from my wardrobe and just try to you know dress it on the paper by using this carbon paper. It was very difficult to dress but with little bit you know math and calculation I have actually made the exact pattern which fit me so well. The length of the fabric was just 2 meters and I was supposed to fit a midi dress into it like how. So I first you know try to place like this like whatever cuttings I have like this and see if I can actually you know cut right amount of fabric out of it. And guess what, surprisingly I had enough fabric to make a midi dress out of it. Just a little note that while cutting the skirt of your dress, don't try to you know cut it in a triangular shape, instead try to cut a little curve. Now let's start with the swing. First I am going to sew all the front pieces that I have like this. So when I was sewing, I was paying attention to the locking the edges where a raw fabric can you know lose the thread so yes I have overlocked each and every piece of the fabric so yes so this is how my front of the dress look after attaching or you can say after sewing all the pieces together so once my front and back are actually you know ready, I have cut the extra lining fabric which I supposed to you know sew from the inside just because my dress is little transparent so yes I am cutting it after you know attaching the front pieces. And the way I have cut the original fabric of the skirt, the same way I also cut the lining material which I require to put inside the skirt like this. You can see in details here. So once all the linings were cut properly, now I am supposed to attach all the lining material which I have cut to the original fabric like this so here I'm simply have started attaching the lining to like front back and also to the skirt after sewing both the pieces together which is lining and the main fabric I'm going to overlock them so there won't be any loose ends This is 
how front and back of the dress look after sewing lining and the original pieces together now just to you know give it a proper finishing i'm just going to do top stitch on the neckline and also at the back of my neckline like here so the you know edges will be flattened professional people might be screaming just after looking what i have you know created the pattern but yes it turned out pretty well so for the beginner like me it is a quite win win situation anyways i have already attached front and back at the shoulder now is time to attach the sleeves my sleeves are attached i am going to attach front of the skirt to front bodice and the back of the skirt to the back bodice and then just sew them together by sideways and yes your dress is going to complete just by giving it proper finishing and also overlock wherever required and is done hope you have liked this video then like this video share your thoughts in the comment section below and also subscribe to my channel if you haven't already like what are you waiting for so yeah thank you so much for watching see you soon